Okay, so Kirk from the Tackle Shop snuck in a challenge on us, and since this one could be a little iffy, I'm inviting an old buddy back who thrives on danger. Oh, I'm running my money today, boy. This time, Brian from Palmero Toyota actually knows what we're doing and still agreed to come. We're going after giant lake trout on giant Lake Erie in little tiny kayaks. What could go wrong? That's what's coming up on Erie Extreme. You're not wanted, you're not in the post office, are you? No, no. You know, there are several reasons why I like to swing by Kirk's every now and then. I don't know what flavor this is, but it might be Cajun. But this right here is the main one. Smoked fish, as good as it gets. Do you think that's the best you've ever had? Yeah, yeah, I did. Thank you. It's by far the best I've ever had, and the luckiest cat on earth likes it too. It's not yours. Get out. <laughs> oh my goodness. Not yours. <laughs> hey. I hear the lake trout are starting to bite. Really? It's supposed to be nice this weekend. You need to catch one of those big lakers out of your kayak. Is that a challenge? Yeah, I guess it is. <laughs> <laughs> Sure, that was easy. I accept this challenge, uh, but I'm definitely not doing it alone. And I know just who to call. I need a daredevil tomorrow. Like daredevil, it's like the survival suit. That's what keeps you alive in case you capsize out in the middle of Lake Erie. Okay. But I only have one and I'm gonna wear it. Okay. <laughs> no, I got two. I'm not planning on falling in. Me neither. Um, in the morning, check with me, cause it's blowing like 20 right now and there's eight foot waves out there, but it's supposed to switch at three in the morning to south. Obviously, if it's eight foot waves, we're not going out there kayak. Bring a hard hat. In case we have some extra time, we could do that crane thing again. Yeah, I'm cool. Okay. How do you feel? Okay. Comfortable? I wouldn't go that far. You look comfortable. All right. Okay, man. Talk to you. Bye. Hi. It surprises me that he would ever come fish with me again. Cool. So Brian's coming up from Meadville tomorrow morning. The weather's supposed to calm down, so I'm getting the kayaks ready. I've never caught a big fish out of the kayak yet, so I'm really excited for tomorrow. What do you think, Brian? Are you scared yet? No, I don't get scared. You'll never be scared after last no. time, right? Why was there to be scared of? These have motors, right, Dave? Um, mine does. Oh, okay. We just got to make sure everything's right. I kind of like orange better, but... <laughs> have you done this before? Kayak? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, so you're good at it. Oh, hey. Yours has a paddle. Mine has this. <laughs> Can we throw that kayak in your truck? Yeah. Look at how it cool it'll out. look. That's the right color. Um, do you have any questions? Concerns? What are we exactly mm. doing? Is that right? Yeah. No, it's not. Yes, it is. Is it? Yes. Okay. <laughs> See if you like that better like that better yeah that's pretty cool although that's more tippy but these don't tip okay <laughs> yeah that's kind of nice we're gonna go try to break the state record lake job okay how big do you remember wasn't it 29 did you guys catch fish in buffalo no we ha have you ever watched the show <clears throat> you just did it we don't catch i know i know you think that. season three is going to be better I'm asking just when you were up there. We filmed 21 episodes this year and we have not caught a fish yet. Are you serious? Is that why you brought me? <laughs> yeah, because we want to just keep it going. Because in, <laughs> in my episode, we caught those monsters. I'm kind of excited. Are you excited? I am excited. Pretty light. It is pretty light. This is going to be fun. Hey, Dave. Yeah. You like the new truck? I love it. Any other little secret tips I need to know about since I live in this thing? <laughs> it got vibrating seats? Uh, depends on how rough the terrain is. Which one did I have last time? You had a limited last time. Now and you have the is... platinum. We keep upgrading you. What's the, what's it go to next? Gold? Uh, Obviously it's nice. The amenities. I mean, is the big thing. You have now like the power steering wheel. You have dual power seats, so just the side. I know my favorite thing. What's that? The uh, cooled seats? Yeah. And the cooled seats, the key. Nothing like fresh air blowing up your butt. <laughs> yeah. Sometimes you feel a little damp, but. <laughs> All right, let's, uh, my life jacket's gonna blow away. 
Is your life jacket gonna blow away, Brian? No, because it's in the front seat. Unless I drive with the windows open and the door. Uh, we can't have smart people on our shows. It's embarrassing. Where's Terry when you need him? You think it's okay out here? Oh, it looks fantastic. It is getting rougher. Uh, okay, let's go. So this is the first day we've got a chance to get out in the kayaks. We got a challenge from our good old buddy, Kirk. It's, it's a little rougher than what I had hoped, but I think it's doable. Can you, can you paddle that far? I can paddle that far. Can How you? far is that? No, yeah, I got a like trolling motor. Oh, okay. <laughs> Is that that is a mile, isn't yeah. it? All the more reason to put the trolling motor on. So you got to get ready. Yeah, I should start paddling now. You know what? We got a lot of things to do here. These are uh, steering cables, so I actually steer it with my feet. Yeah, this is the kill switch. So if I fly out of the kayak when one of those fish pulls me out, it's magnetic. It's connected to my life jacket. It'll shut the motor off so it doesn't chop my neck in half. This black cord lifts the motor. Look at how it glimmers in the sun. That looks nice. So I just ordered all this stuff. Lured Jensen is owned by Rapala. And I was like always thinking, what am I ever going to do with Lure Jensen stuff? And then lo and behold, they have all of these spoons. You got to peel the lead out so that you can tie a knot because you can't tie a knot with this. There it is. I feel like you could catch a freaking tuna. Look at that. I'm going to be on fire. Am I have an official Nerd now. Spoon nerd. Spoon nerd. You're gonna float. This just buys you extra time. That's good. You're gonna have four hours to get to land. <laughs> I mean, we could just go with life jackets, but you'll freeze if you fall in and die. Right? I hope not. Just so you know, you'll float with just the pants or just the coat. All we gotta do is get you offshore. I'm good. Don't flip it. Thanks, Dave. Boy, yeah. it looks small on Lake Erie, doesn't it? See, that's what we gotta try to avoid. See that big wave coming? I got my foot wet. Is this gonna be good? Are you comfortable? Comfortable as you can be on Lake Erie in a kayak? And we're off. Now that we're off the bank, it's actually pretty nice out here. Uh, we're gonna destroy this challenge. It's gonna be so easy. Ah, there we go. Probably could be easier with the motor since you don't have to use, you know, holding the rod and the paddle is gonna be challenging. Already? I'm not Are whining, I'm just, no, I was just making a point. So we gotta not hit each other because that's what causes people to flip over. Yeah. Okay, here we go. We're fishing. I don't know how smart you are, but don't run into any other boats, because they're all bigger than that. The last thing I need is for Brian to survive fishing from a crane just to get run over by a boat. Did you get one? No. I mean, I don't know what to do. If, I don't, if we don't start getting bites, do we switch colors? I mean, these waves are getting bad, dude. Like, too bad to go into them. Definitely more of a ridiculous, challenge. ridiculous, man. It's not supposed to blow this way. I just looked at it again this morning. You know, I distinctly <laughs> remember you saying we'd have trolling motors, but you, you didn't say I I would have a trolling motor. No, I never said have a trolling motor. That's not true. I mean, I'm getting a workout on my thumb. Yeah, I imagine. <laughs> I hope you don't blister. Did you <laughs> Did you ever play video games when you were younger? For a long, that's how I feel right now. Yeah, I almost feel bad right now. Look, Mom, no hands. <laughs> you want to switch boats for the rest of the way? Nah, that, then I can't say I did it the whole day. Well, no state record today. Nope, I think I set a state record for paddling. Well, we're back on the beach already. It just figures, the weatherman screwed up again. You're the man. And just like that, challenge failed. <laughs> you only paddle for three miles max, tops. Okay. How much did you paddle? I, I paddled to get off the... You yeah, said, I saw it. That's a solid 100 yards. Please support our Season 3 partners. Marquette Savings Bank. Fast Signs. We Create. The Avonia Tavern. Fishing Online. Bentley Tree Care. East End Angler, Palmero Toyota, the Pennsylvania Fish and Boat Commission, and Visit Erie. It's a beautiful day. I gave up on the kayaks, but not on the Lakers. And I found me a new sucker. Ready? 
out here fishing for Lakers and six foot swells. Oh, fish up. Wow, that was fast. You got him? Yeah. We just start fishing and Mark's hooked up already. He's got a lot of spunk for a little guy. It's not a laker, it's a little steelhead, but at least it's something. He's pretty though, man. This week's episode of Deary Extreme's Deadliest Catch. <laughs> oh, fish, fish. Is that a walleye? Whoa, look at this big wave. Hang on, hang on. Big wave, big wave. Oh, get him in here. That's a bonus. Walleye equals happy wife. Is that dinner? Yeah. Oh well, they died doing what they love to do. <laughs> yeah, it's getting windy. Big lake, it doesn't take much. We got us a north wind blowing in here all of a sudden. So we're heading back. Daddy O's nervous. That was a big one. <laughs> this is going to be a little bit scary going through here. Well, the stupid weather got us again. No Lakers today. Yeah, well, <laughs> we made it. Should we? Look at that. <laughs> oh well that was a little bit dumb but we made it very hairy out there Alrighty then lakers take three you know this is starting to get personal now i think this is the first time that everyone's been on time ever morning boys morning how you doing check this out dude mice got to it in the in the storage unit -uh. look <laughs> Uh, this is my friend Nolan. Uh, we go to Gannon together and we're on the fishing team. Yep. We we're ranked 16th in the country out of like 200 college teams. Been a good year, yeah. Looking forward to next year. You think we can catch a 100 pounder today? <laughs> I don't know about 100, but I think we can get 31. Or what is the state third? record? Did you look it up? Like 29 and a half pounds. It was caught in Erie County, Lake Erie. I'm Ann. Ann, nice to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet you too. Have fun today. Thank you. You want to come, Isabelle? Whoa. So are we fishing today? You ready? So someone's anxious, and so am I, but the weather doesn't look too promising. Oh boy. Just that little bit of wind kind of gets in your head a little bit with this little boat. Bald eagle, America's bird. I'm not sure Dave knows what a bald eagle looks like. I know a bald eagle when I see one. It's flat inside the marina, but we're a little worried about what we might find outside the break wall. Oh yeah, look at that. Oh man, that is so much nicer. You still feel pretty confident? Yeah, they're actually, actually they're bigger than I thought they were. We just can't be stupid about it, you know? Well, running real far on Lake Erie in a 14-foot boat is stupid no matter how you look at it. Yeah, not calm, but... Yeah, I wouldn't say calm, but it's doable right now. We just, you know how quickly things can change. So what are we going to do? Are we going to put three out? Try to do three? Or just two? I think maybe just two for starters, because it's going to be a little challenging. Are we putting it on a clicker or something I like mean, that? I mean, it's just like just like your bait caster for bass fishing. Oh, no, it's not. <laughs> Thanks for that. So, also, we're just going to hold them, though. We're not going to... We can. Yeah, we can hold them just for Just to now. start? OK. I do want to feel one jacket. I can't imagine like feeling <laughs> one bite it, you know? Hey, first time trolling out of my trawler. It's called a trawler. Hey, this boat was built for it. <laughs> okay, here we go. I'm gonna mark this right here. Because I'm cocky. Big fish right there? No, that's the lip on that first comb. Okay. It's cold. I've ice fished on warmer days than this. Can't even imagine it happening. That's why I just don't think it's gonna happen. It's too good to be you gotta true. Gotta imagine it. It's good. You gotta envision it. It's gonna happen. So if we're gonna hold our rods, why, why did you make me drill holes in my butt? We're gonna try to throw a third rod out. I like this idea. I think we're just paying attention too much, you know? Starting to rain harder. It's nasty out here. Fish, fish! Over there. Oh. Well, I, I, I... Holy crap. Okay, that's not a steelhead. There ain't no way that's a steelhead. Nope, that's a laker. How many you got in there? One. Oh yeah, this is big. I'm gonna put a weight to me. I can't believe how strong this fish is. I'm gonna turn my clicker off so I don't sound like a moron. What is this, a bass in it? <laughs> is that too small? Dude, I hope this is my first laker. It sure doesn't feel like a steel. <gasps> oh my it's a laker. god. Holy crap. <laughs> Can you believe that? Yeah. Can you believe that? <laughs> you did it. <laughs> that is yeah. So that's not even a giant. No. That's like we don't have state record concerns right now. No. Oh my god. 14 pounder. Alright, so this is my first laker. I don't want to get soaking wet because it's 
39 degrees. Look at that. He's a fat one. I put a waypoint there, so we just do that same path, right? Again. Yeah, let's just get back to it. Got one, got one. It's a little one, steelhead. No, it's a little. I've never seen a laker that small. <laughs> Dang. Wow. <laughs> Minus one to you. <laughs> Smallest laker he's ever seen in his life. <laughs> that don't deserve a high five, though. Laker number two. It's a giant. This is the waypoint. And I hope this wind doesn't last long. It's supposed to switch out of the south. But right now, it's like northwest. I do not like these waves at all. What do you think we should do? Turn in? Oh, yeah. Yeah, turn in. So, just so you know, Oh, got one, got one. Oh my God, this is a big one, dude. Dude. That's a good one. Yeah, this is a good one. <laughs> oh, now I know what a big one feels like. Wow. God, I hope you don't get off. Oh, man. Now we just gotta try not to flip over in the excitement, man. Flipping over is bad. Okay, so these things really you need a big net. <laughs> oh my gosh, the weight of it is unreal. Look at that thing, look at that thing. Ready? Is this okay up here? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we gotta get this one. Oh my god. <laughs> Still not over 20, right? Oh yeah. I know what I'm doing though, dude. Switching bait. Yep. <laughs> my hooks are bent out. Like they're I got one hook is straight out. Is that the one you had on there? You're gonna seriously copy me? I've never done this before. You should use a dub bait. You should use something that I put that on there. <laughs> anyway. This one's going to the minnow man. Senior Master Smokermeister Sir. I'm gonna put a waypoint there. It's cool because we are able to predict the bites. I can see when we're gonna get a bite. What are those? Bald eagles. You don't usually see that many in a flock. Me and my buddy Mark out here on Lake Year doing a little trolling. Got the little four-stroke mercury going down here. Keeping her down at 1.9 miles an hour. Glad I put them rod holders on my boat. They're coming in handy. Something I swore I would never do in my entire life. I'm doing it. I'll explain why later. <laughs> <laughs> Drill some holes in your boat. Come on, rain. Golly. We're gonna go back. As soon as we turn around. Oh, fish on. Boom. <laughs> Are you sure? Boy, I, that sinks that I got a real in. Which direction? Oh my gosh, I just had a bite, like a hard bite. Dang it, we could have had a double. I had one smoke mine. That's a big one, huh? Is it bigger than mine? Oh well, yeah. <laughs> I figured you'd say that. Come on, Marky Mark, don't lose them. He's a big one. No, oh, that's way bigger than mine. You sucker. I knew you were going to do that. <laughs> Four. How long did that take? Yeah. <laughs> He's not really. He's about no, the same, huh? He's about the same, yeah. Yeah. How long did we troll? Just Two minutes. Instantly. There. That was the bottom. I had to do it. Oh, I got one. I got one. Yeah? No. Yeah, it's a fish. Oh my gosh. I can't believe that's a fish. Look at that. I thought I was snagged. Yeah. So that means it's got to be a giant, doesn't it? Yeah, it's a good one. You all right? Yep. Heavy, heavy, heavy. Heavy, dude. This is amazing. Catching all these big, giant fish that I've never caught before. <laughs> I can't get over how freaking cool this is. See him? <laughs> Look at these fish. Oh, man. Can you believe this? Yeah. <laughs> what? They're all, they're all about the same size. Yeah. <laughs> unbelievable. I mean, this is, dude, this is, this is unbelievable. World-class lake trout fishing in here. It is. World-class everything we do. Look at that sucker. That's my biggest one so far. <laughs> but we're not done yet. They're fat. I wasn't expecting them to be fat. Most yeah. of the pictures I've seen, they're long and skinny. Oh, we don't usually get technical on this show. You can see we're using spoons, but in this case, our line is actually more important than our baits. We're using Suffix 832 braid main line, 50 pound test. And then we're using Suffix advanced 832 lead core. It's literally like the same braided line just wrapped around that lead. That looks like a good one. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna hit a waypoint here. Yeah, it's definitely bigger than the last one. Oh my gosh, this wind is starting to crank right now. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Look at that. Yeah. 
How big is that? How big is that? That's a good 18. Look at the size of this thing. Yeah. Look at that. What a tank. <laughs> Look at how wide. That's a tank. Oh, that, that one could be 20. God, I can't imagine if that's, it's not. That's, that could be. Look at that. We're going to let him go. Cool. Back in the water. Okay. Here we go again. How many we got now? Six? Yeah. You're crushing them. Yeah, the same yeah we got everything's the same. Skill. Yeah. <laughs> what? Look at he holds, he holds he holds the pole different. I'm holding my mouth. I'm doing that when I got there. <laughs> I mean we haven't passed over this and not got a fish. No. We haven't even covered this yet. Like not even remotely. Yeah. I can't believe oh, oh. we have There's a fish. Fish on. I was just gonna say I can't believe it. So wanting to get a double so bad. Is he Do going it. left or right? I gotta get He's this. Under the boat. Hey, I'm putting my rod in the rod holder. There you go. Don't lose him. I just felt felt him hit the motor or something. I'm on the wrong side of the boat. I know. You wanna deal with it or you wanna go around? Uh, go around. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah. Go around. Okay, I got it. Oh yeah, it's another good one. This is on the rail. Dude, this is your biggest one today. This could be bigger than mine. Reaching way out. There we go. Alright, he's in the net. Yeah, dude, that's just that's I'm gonna say it's not as big as mine, <laughs> but it is the second biggest one. Yeah. Nice. Nice. That's so big. <laughs> hey, buddy. Oh, yeah, that was gross. <laughs> That's number seven. Fishing for what? An hour and a half max. Crushing it. Best picture of all time, right here. I don't know if we should. Pretty windy. I mean, you want to try to catch one more? All right, yeah. It's white cap. It's though. getting a little hairy. I don't like these waves at all. I mean, it's supposed to switch to the south. It's this like is... you just want to wait. This is bad. Yeah. We can't even troll into this right now. We'd take every single wave over the front. Should we just go back the other way? Go this way? Yeah. You just start heading back. You can't go that way. We're going to try going this way. The biggest one that we caught was down here. Okay, boys, we're right where the big one was. See how good we are. So we're having the time of our lives today out on the big lake, but in all seriousness, the lake is nothing to play around with. <laughs> oh boy. It can turn deadly in a heartbeat. We have to catch a double. We got eight right now that would put us at 10. It would be so awesome. Oh, there might be a water spout coming. See that one little? Yeah, sure looks like Keep an eye on that, because that's what they look, then they just all of a sudden drop. Yeah, that's definitely one. Yeah. Okay, reel them in. All right. We're gonna make one more pass downwind. Hopefully we can pick up two more. Our goal is a state record and a double. And to live to see tomorrow. I'm not asking too much. A double state record. A double state record. <laughs> there you go, what he said. Despite the forecast, the wind and waves are steadily building. So we've decided to be safe instead of sorry, and we're heading in. That was awesome though, wasn't it? You it was have great. Yeah. We made it too. We, we, we made it back. I'm glad we came in though now because that was getting a little hairy. What do you think? Huh? It's getting bigger. How you doing? I'm fine. How you doing? Kirk will be here in a few. Oh, is he coming? Yeah, like I told a... him you asked for him. We need a bigger scale. Yeah, you got one right over there. Oh, you want to smoke? You're going to, you're going to do this sucker. Yeah. What, what are they? Are they good? They are really good, but they're not good for you. My question to you would be, would you rather eat fruity pebbles or a fish with mercury in it? <laughs> oh, definitely you know what I mean? fish with mercury. Yeah. <laughs> Let's go with the mercury. Well, thanks a lot for the challenge, Kirk. This was quite the experience. Today actually made me forget I failed the challenge. Bummer. But guess what? I don't care because I caught my first and biggest laker ever, probably over 20 pounds, but we'll never know. I cannot wait to take another crack at this one in the kayak. Hi. Hey, Brian. Dave. Yeah. Hey, what are you doing tomorrow? Hello?